What's up, friends of the good mood? It's Manny, and welcome back to Amnesia Rebirth. Um, yeah, I think we found out in the last episode what we need to do. And uh, that would be getting inside the cage. So what I think we need to do is get the cage in here, jump in, scan ourselves, and then move away. Because we, if we are here in the cage, we will actually be able to move this lever from here. So that should all be working. Let's do this. Boom. Climbing up. We need to wait for an empty cage to come. Yep, empty cage is here. It will scan now. It will notice that there is a life form. Okay. Then it moves us here and will show a scan. Of ourselves. There it is, the baby. There you are. <laughs> I thought... I thought you might be a dream. Or that there was... That something had gone wrong. <laughs> okay. So now we have confirmation, obviously, that... What? What's that? Something is uh, noticing something. By the way, look at them! Look at them boobies. Yeah, nicely big and probably probably growing through the pregnancy. So what's with this thing now? Finally, the button will do something. Huh? I. I don't like this. It says something about the baby. Sickness. Sickness. Wasting. The child will be born with a sickness. It will waste her to nothing. I can help her. I can save her. How? And are we going to trust this? Yeah, I mean, so far she has only helped us. She's ill, I remember. Oh God. Just like Alice, what do I do? Help me! Aid within these walls. Follow me. Aid within these walls. Yeah, as it's just as I thought, we have to go this way through the thing. Uh, yeah, it has some some illness, and it detected that. Crazy, it's more advanced than uh, than our our current medical um, medicine. This this all this stuff that we're at here right now. Hold on, I need to check if the sound volume is all correct. Test test. Okay, good to know. All right, so let's go, ladies and gents. Okay, here we go. Alright, so it will now grab us up here. If there's something in here that's gonna help you, I've got to try it. Anything. So the next the new baby would have the same illness as the previous as Alice. And that's why we're doing this here now. Hold on, we're gonna get dropped here. Ah! Oh, damn it! Yeah, better than falling, I guess. I jumped out early so that... 
Because otherwise, look, it would have dropped us right there. Maybe, I don't know. Look, he was chained up. The guy that was just in the cage was chained up. Okay. Poof. Um, so now at least we know what we want to do. What we that has priority number one, even before getting to uh, to the town. And maybe this is why we can never get to the town because maybe the lady prevents us from getting to the town because she notices or knows the illness and she knows we have to first get this solved before we can make our escape. Because she says the the cure is within these walls. Pretty dark, isn't it? But we're not scared yet. We are just crawling through a dark place. So far, no monsters inside, so that's that's a good thing. Green flame, huh? Uh... Holy smokes, what the heck is this? Spikes. We're getting scared again like crazy. Yeah, that's a good question. Another monster? I'm not sure I, I want to be here, guys. And why are the spikes at the end of that tunnel? Oh, there's a door out. Okay. Oh, my heart. She died, did she not? Yeah, she died. Alice, her previous child. First child died. Salim and Tassi lost their child. Diagnostician. Diagnostician. Uh, achievement unlocked. Whoa, where were we now? Back in this crazy world with the uh, crazy sky and everything. This place is... Some sort of station, I think. Yeah, look, it looks like these are uh, uh, like um, like carriages or some kind of things that drive you around, get you to different parts. Okay, this can't move. This doesn't work either. Okay. Look, those bright places. I think they're more rifts back to our world. Can we get to one of them? Hmm. But do we want to? Right now we want we have a different priority, don't we? Right now the priority is getting the 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 cure for your baby. Uh, did you hear that, guys? There was some kind of monster sounding again. Why is it always... Okay. <laughs> by my knee delivers constant chatter about the honeycomb he found. Phila, little face, serious, tongue stuck out as she draws in the earth with his stick. 
Hermia catches the boy up in her arms and flashes me a tired smile. I too am tired, but I am grateful for this day. It's a memory, I think. It is time. I hold her down, stroking her neck. She is oblivious, nuzzling at me. I thank her for her company, for her comfort, for her nourishment. I cut her throat swiftly. What? She complains, but it does not take long. I catch the blood in a clay pot. She will save us this winter. I hope they're talking about a cow. And not a human person. Uh, or even if it's not a cow, some some animal. I'm hoping they're they're referring to. Even if it wouldn't really, it's not even much, you know. Even if it's an, an animal, it's still insanely brutal. But I somehow like the the thought less of the, the these people doing that to other humans. Huh? Hand. And some l numbers or letters. I hope I don't have to remember them. What the heck is this? Is it like a tricorder from Star Trek? Hello? Anyone here? Some kind of rail system? No, power. Power is generating through these or flowing through this, I guess. Okay, more numbers and um, things. That looks weird. That's not a human, human being. That's a different type of organism. Is this what the, uh, what the physical, um, what if, is this the physique of, uh, of the people who are lived in this world? Maybe did they look like that? Here, this is the place I can help Amari. The time is life against sickness. What do I have to do? Create the time. Sit. Be. The energy that powered the portal, right? Because that was so easy to find last time. <laughs> right. Don't worry, Amari. There must be a way to make it here. She wouldn't have said it. All right. So sitting Space. here. Needs energy to bring it to life, I think. Yep. Oh, another of these energy devices. Okay, there's this way to go, and there is... Yeah, this is, I think, where we need to put the energy device in. Let's use the lantern here. I cannot go here? No, it won't let me go this way. Ah, look, there's already one of those uh, bodies that we will probably then need to create the Vitae power thingy stuff. So, yeah. Let's go and try and find another one of those powered... Oh, look, we're at the other side of this now. We can actually go out. Outside. Something is powering these things, so... Ah! Look. This is, uh, this is one of the power generation things. Yeah, this powers, um, these, these, uh... Si little Cylons, or whatever you call those things, that... Those transmitters. Energy transmitters. 
That's the station again. All right, I think we need to probably drive around with these things down there to different places on this world to find the Vitae, right? The ultimate goal now is to uh, heal uh, Amari, our little unborn child, and then once we did that, Uh, dental return to the city. Have we been here already? think so what the heck there's someone in there still alive yeah this is how we create the vitae but i need an empty vitae thing first is there a way to get light into this place Freaking dark here everywhere. I want to light up this room. I need energy. Oh no, this is where energy comes from. I don't think I can get it open. I'm sorry. I have no way to help you. Not only are we not going to help you, we're probably going to extract energy from it. Um, what does that say? Under the sign of Edu on the twelfth rise at the second seal uh, calling, I, Arathru, make this record. The cycle of replenishing is now as follows. One application is of elixir of power of emerishi that the memories of the pain be eased. One application of elixir of power of emerish, emerish that the memories of the pain will be erased. So we need that elixir. Then application of extracted material to raise level of inda above indication level that the subject's potential be maximized. So recorded Uh huh. I wish this room was a little bit brighter because look, I'm constantly getting these fear flashes. And uh, yeah, maybe we can light it up. Maybe we can. Oh, that's a lot of stuff to read here now. Uh, subject of 145SV, initial extraction indicates worker class with a familiar structure consisting of the partner of a partner and two offspring at the time of capture. High potential yield. Per protocol, focus further extraction on early contract with partner and uh, formative years of offspring. In addition, typical strong memories relate to ca capture location and parental connection. Wow, these guys are sick. They are talking about humans. Subject 1444, the initial extraction indicates worker class, no immediate family, but a strong connection to a single individual, average potential yield, focus further extraction on contracts with, the individ with that individual, ignoring all pre-adult memories as no familiar, familiar connection typically indicates no positive material to use. Uh, subject one four, uh, blah, initial ext extraction indicates subservient class, no immediate family, low potential yield, focus for the extraction on earliest memories, but also consider discard. Whoa. Under the sign of Edu, on the fourth rise, 
eyes at the second calling, I, Atharu, make this record. Research into the revised chamber has led to a breakthrough. Introducing the memory capsules allows for a more intense reaction to the pain, rising to a tensor level of 17 immediately. Subjects no longer rapidly burn out. Our supply problem is solved. Direct stimulation of the nerves, followed by a dose of elixir of emerish, followed by application of the subject's own best memory. Or to view it another way, fear, oblivion, hope. Fear, oblivion, hope. It's so simple. Without fear, there is no vitae. Without hope, there is no fear. So recorded in her name eternal. This is very, very disturbing. I mean, I'm seriously, I'm very disturbed by this. Oh man. It is the first time I have seen him in a week. And it is as if 10 years have bent his spine, sapping the flesh and the color from his cheeks. His eyes are red rimmed. They will not meet mine. Fear grips my heart and starts to squeeze. Son, he says. She is with the gods now. Uh huh. So these things, they, they give a little bit of background behind the story. Ah, look, this is what I was looking for. Oh, look at them. I wonder who they were. I need to tell you about Alice, little one. She was your sister, for a while, in our little rooms in Paris. It was just the three of us. She loved stories. And she loved to play in the park. And she... She's with your father now. And you're with me. Whoa! What is this? What is going on? It's looking for something. I can't be seen by it. What? It's some kind of monster. What is this, dude? Some kind of ghost. Okay, this is creepy as flip. What if I put this away from it again? Man, this is... What is this monster? I feel like I have to do something in that room. But it's still there. I need that, uh, that transmitter. Maybe I can lure it somewhere by throwing things. Yeah. Uh-oh. No! Oh my god, what is this thing? And now I transmutate in my own monster and I punch the crap out of it. That would be cool. That would be really good.
Same as I did with Richard. Or, or was it Leon? No, I think it was Richard. Holy smokes, man! This is this is getting crazy. At first, you know, the, the game started a bit slow, but now I'm really, I'm really liking this. Uh, although I'm also very afraid of it. But is it still here? It's not here anymore. Under the sign of Ulan on the eight rise at the fourth calling, uh, I Atar will make this record. The memory view process has undergone refinement by Suvar. Short bursts of memory are optimal. Combined with a new new elixir, the memory cycle now reaches full application at no longer than 57 Idar. 57. Full application. Our goal is now to reduce the cycle of pain to improve this public perception of the process. Temak, who has ordered it, and it must be. So, blah. Holy crap, dude. So I have to inject. Alright, let's bring this thing along. Because I feel like we need to bring it this way. Now we can use whatever this is. That might be our ride out of here. Okay. Uh, but we still haven't... We need energy first at the thing, right? We need to heal our baby. We're not going anywhere before that happened. Ah, here we go. Oh God. It's alive. This guy is alive. Hello, can you hear me? I don't know. Grunt or something if you can hear me. Christ, so close, but I can't reach you. Oh God, even if you can hear me, I don't know how to get you out. I don't think we're getting him out. I think we're using him too. To get the Vitae thing and uh, Vitae uh, and to extract energy from him. That's probably what, what we're going to be doing. There's another one too. I would be careful with. Oh, wait, there's a button. Uh, do we need a power source? Oh, yeah, we need an empty one here so that we can fill it up. I think that's what's going to happen here. We need an empty power cell. Let's bring this thing along. What happens if I do this, by the way? Okay. No, this is where we came from. This is not the right way. Where was this chair? Uh, this chair for healing. Where was this thing? Is it this one here? Yeah, this... Okay, we are in the right room. Yeah. The thing is, we don't... 
What happens if I sit on it now? This doesn't seem to be working. Have I missed something? Huh. Okay, yeah, let's check out. The, there's energy lines on the bottom. I must have missed something I can place here. Some kind of power source. Or, or battery like thingy. Uh huh. See, this is fun to, to figure out how these things work without actually even knowing the technology. I get why Rodney McKay is so excited when he first stepped on Stargate Atlantis. Oh, look, this looks like it could fit in there. Aha! Uh -huh. That's only half of it, though. Is there another one somewhere? Can I now use this? No, I cannot. Look, there's a second one, but where do I put the second one? Maybe now sit in the chair? I don't think so though. We need we need energy to flow this this way first. And that's not yet energy, I think. Ah. Alright, so ladies and gents, time to end this episode. Um we're gonna find out where this goes. Because look, there is these these yellow cables. But these these yellow cables are not yet online. We need all of them online. We need to follow the cables and find out where to place the other the other energy battery thingy that goes here. Through the wall, maybe? No? I don't know. We're gonna find out, ladies and gents, in the next episode. Thanks for watching. Until then, Manny signing off. Bye-bye.